It was another beautiful day at Frickerstown Station. The weather was hot, but suddenly it became cool and immense, as it always should be on the island of Sodor. <sighs> Bowler was reflecting on the memory of Patrick as he looked into the heavens. The others didn't know about this, neither did Eric or D199. I myself knew about this as I was resting in the signings, not knowing that Ivan the Russian Diesel was about to shunt Eric's coaches. We both made amends, and I even apologized for the, the, uh, the incident back in 2018, which was a bearing that lifted off his shoulders. Ivan shunted the coaches onto Eric as he was about to make his way to the mainland. Sir Topham had arrived. Eric, you're doing very well, and I must say, for you taking passengers, huh, you haven't done that in a while. But in in any cases, make sure you bring that train from Bridlington and return back this evening. We have important news coming along this way, and uh, many other things are going to happen, so please return soon. I'll do my best, sir, said Eric with uh, great triumphantness. Of course we will, said the drivers and firemen. They both ran to the cab, and it was excited. Good. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go and uh, do something. So about ran away as fast as could watch the favorite show. Eric, the Bowler ran away. At Barrow, the celebrations of the novel's success was immense. As photos and autographs were being taken, I reflected on the many things. Katrina was speaking to Ivan. Both made amends for what happened. Katrina forgave Ivan for everything, and Ivan felt like the burden was lifted off his buffers. But then, Sir Topham had arrived from watching his favorite show. Ah, Katrina, you and Brandon are doing very well again. My goodness, the popularity has gone so immense over this novel. <laughs> Great job, my friends. And, uh, and Ivan, I see that you're here. Excellent. I'm glad that you have made amends, even though I wasn't there for said events. But, at least, all is well that ends well. And Sir Topham turned his field, walked violently away, and he had to go fast. 199, Eric and Bowler overlooked and were impressed with Katrina. They wanted to talk to her, but then, Well, that's all cue. We gotta go, mates, said Eric. And Eric towed 199 and Bowler and his train all the way to Bigger's Town. As soon as the three engines left, Ivan, myself, and Katrina resumed our friendly conversation. We reflected on the many funny incidents that happened over the past few years, especially the ones that were deemed almost recoverable, but were recoverable. As the sun set it, the last of the photographers were taking their photographs. We reflected on the celebration of the novel success that Katrina created. I was proud of her. And so were the other engines that were, once again, on the island of Sodor.